Fort Worth might be Cowtown, but just like any town, it faces a spreading virus with no cure and countless side effects, including the meat case is going to have less in it, a meat problem. And I think you're going to see higher prices. It's not really a meat shortage. It's a stoppage and it could be temporary. At least 15 meat processing facilities in 19 states have had more than 4,900 coronavirus cases and 20 deaths. Because cases are going up, production at these plants is going down. So grocery stores have less meat, and they are limiting what customers can buy. And it's really the stores trying to make sure that there's some product for everybody. Uh, so we don't have another toilet paper deal. But it doesn't mean we're out of meat. Don Ray would know. After 40 years in the meatpacking industry, he and some partners launched a gourmet butcher shop in Fort Worth. The meat board just opened in January. So I, I think we're OK. But will Texas ranchers be OK? If processing plants can't safely return to previous capacities, demand and prices for livestock will tank. I think this is going to last for a while, but it really is dependent on the path of the virus. Yet again, uncertainty rules, even in a state where beef does too. In Fort Worth, I'm Teresa Woodard.